How's it going guys? It's Thomas on Planet Tech and you are watching my 2022 LEGO Star Wars clone army video. After showcasing my droid army just a few weeks ago, which you can check out via the link in the description, it's now time for me to share my clone army. This army started in about 2009 up until about 2013 and then I entered my dark ages and I rebooted my love for LEGO collecting in 2020 at the beginning of the pandemic and uh, yeah this is where i'm at now i'm really excited to show you guys my 750 plus clone army so let's not delay any further So leading the army, we have the Clone Army Customs Phase 2 Captain Rex, which I just absolutely love and will be reviewing on the channel soon. So subscribe if you don't want to miss that. And I do my armies uh, in squads of 25 for the clones. I think it looks really satisfying. I hope you guys can agree. But yeah, starting over on the right here, we have 25 of the Phase 2 Kashyyyk Troopers. We've got the Kashyyyk Scouts there. The Geonosian Troopers, the Geonosian Airborns. Coming back over here, we have 150 of the 501st Phase 2 Troopers, which I just love. They look awesome. And then we have 50 of the Jetpack Troopers from the 501st. Coming over here, we have 100 of the regular uh, Phase 1 Clone Wars style uh, Troopers. <laughs> uh, we have 25 of those Clone Wars Gunners. Uh, 25 horn company and another 50 bomb squad troopers plus a couple more that you'll see in the back there in a second coming back to the front we have some of the realistic phase one troopers we've got some aft troopers there as well this is the only squad that's kind of got mixed numbers at least in the 25 there's 10 of the sergeants and 25 of the rank or battalion aft troopers i hope to have 25 of each of those in the next clone army video so uh yeah hopefully that will be by the end of the year or maybe uh early next year and here we have 25 of the 501st cold assault troopers these are using aerial light helmets on regular uh snow trooper bodies as well as a capes for minifigs waist cape so yeah they look pretty cool uh if i do say so myself coming up to the back here we kind of got some squads of random figures um, and just numbers that didn't make it into the army and, and kind of rarer clones as well. So starting over here, we've got some phase two uh, recon troopers, both styles there, the, the old, uh, like 2008, I think. Uh, no, maybe even earlier than that, probably, yeah, probably definitely earlier than that, 2005 maybe. Uh, we've got the shock troopers there, and I think they're 41st elite phase twos, I think. I can't remember the names of all these, I'll be honest. We've got Commander Gree with a couple of scouts that didn't make the 25. We've got the Bad Batch there as well. We've got some 327 troopers, 332nd troopers, uh, some regular of the Phase 2 um, older style troopers. We've got some two, we've got A212 trooper and a couple of the regular Phase 2s, the animated style, I think we're in that animated style. Uh, the three of the airborne troopers from the General Grievous Starfighter and a couple more Geonosis airbornes. We've got some Clone Wars 501st troopers there, some pilots as well. We've got some of the ARC troopers. I don't know where all the cloth and stuff for four of those are, but uh, I'm sure they're around somewhere. And we've got four of the uh, Phase 2 gunners as well. Coming across here, we've got some of the Clone Wars pilots. We have... Uh, some random a section of gunners and uh, half troopers and pilots that is proper random uh, squad there we've got some more um, of the realistic phase one troopers 
we have three of the commanders that come with the 2013 ATTE, and same with the sergeants, I think they are, um, or captains. I think they might be captains, actually. And then we've got three of the realistic pilots there. Got a load of Senate commandos at the back there. Um, and these are the commanders from the new 2022 figure pack with the realistic troopers. I hope to really grow that by the next time I do an army video. We've got some of the original phase one troopers there as well. And then we're back onto some of the named characters. So we've got Gree, Rex, Cody, Wolf, and two Wolf pack troopers and an odd Senate commando at the back there as well. I need to find out where all the armor and stuff uh, went for all those figures, but yeah. 756 troopers all together which is just an awesome awesome army i love them i think they look so cool uh in their squads of 25 so uh yeah now we will get on to some of the ships so we have four gunships in total we have three of the 2013 style and then one of the 2008 gunships uh, we've got an atrt which i think came in one of the turbo tanks um, I've only got four of the ATRTs from the battle packs built, but uh, yeah, I do have like 50 of them, um, but I just ended up parting out the rest of them. We've got three of the command stations there from the new figure pack. And now heading towards the back there, we've got the old Republic cruiser. Now, not technically a clone ship as this was seen in episode one. I just love it. It's so cool. Um, and considering I've also got the Republic frigate as well, I figured I'd throw it in there. They're practically the same ship, right? Um, but yeah, so we've got that, we've got a, a Republic attack shuttle, we've got three Freco speeders, three of the 2013 ATTEs, we got some of the speeders from the 501st Battle Pack, we have this insane mock uh, from 501st uh, Battle Packs, if you know, you know. We've got two of the Swamp Speeders, two fighter tanks, the 2008 one and the 2017 one, I want to say, but I'm not quite sure about that. We've got a Z95 Headhunter there as well with that Republic Cruiser there. Um, and then we've got two uh, 2010 Turbo Tanks and one of the more recent ones, I think 2016 maybe. Uh, we've got two of the 2008 ATTEs and then three ATAPs APs from 2019, two of them, and one from 2008. Now I do have the Republic dropship and ATOT, but I do need to rebuild those. And I also have another 2010 turbo tank that I need to build as well. Um, but other than that, that is all of my vehicles um, in my clone army. So yeah, I would definitely get them built this year and, uh, and display them when I do my next clone army video. But that is the entire army guys if you have enjoyed this video then please do give it a thumbs up if you're new to the channel then subscribe i can't wait to start doing mocks and bringing mocks to the channel and including a load of these figures and uh, a load of these ships as well because yeah this is awesome and i love seeing all these videos uh i love seeing the layouts of of all these sets and all these figures together so if you have to please do like please do subscribe and i'll see you in the next one guys goodbye